So in my world, the biggest difference between these drones and picking one over the other would be the wind resistance of the drone. I would expect the Mini 3 to be pretty capable in wind, especially with the new gimbal construction. I would expect that the tilt angle that you can achieve with the drone is much higher than it is compared to the Mini 2. And the Mini 2 is actually doing a pretty good job in the wind as well. If we take a look at the spec sheets, the maximum tilt angle that can be achieved with the Air 2S right now is 35 degrees. It's actually only 30 degrees when it's flying forward and it's 20 when it's flying backward and it is a 35 when it goes to either side. We don't know the exact numbers for the Mini 3 as it is right now, but if we just take a look at the Mini 2, we can see that the maximum tilt angle on a normal operation is 25 degrees, but it can be pushed up to 40 degrees if it's being really put under pressure with high wind. And I can confirm that the, the wind performance of uh, the Mini 2 is actually quite stellar and uh, the Mini 3 will likely be even better. But just a fun fact, both Air 2S and Mini 2 are both classified for wind level 5. Where the maximum wind speed is stated for 10.7 meters per second for the Air 2S, the wind resistance is stated as an interval from 8.5 to 10.8 for the Mini 2. And my interpretation of that is that 8.5 is what is valid when it's operating in normal mode and you will be able to push it up to 10.8 if uh, you really push the tilt angle up to the maximum 40 that is allowed. Which could cause problems as we have all seen flying in sport mode with the gimbal being knocked out of position. All of this makes me to believe that regardless of the Mini 3 performance that we would see, the Air 2S will still take the wind when we are talking wind. Because of the increased prop diameter and that it's heavier and has more motor power. So if high wind is your thing, then you might wanna to stick to your Air 2S or at least keep it. I hope you liked this video. If you did, then feel free to give it a like. If you didn't like it, feel free to press the dislike button twice. Thank you for watching and I'll be seeing you around.